So now this is what I was talking about yesterday and what I plan on changing this week and working on. You can really tell he's been intubated. You can see the canines and the narrowing. Almost gives like a little, I, I, it looks like a little sparrow looking to peck, right? And again, the narrowness of the head and, and it's gone in. So intubation comes in, but also too, if there's been cannulation or NG tubes, then the tagoderm tape goes here, goes around, and then it jams underneath the hyoid bone. And that's also too where you get that drop in the jaw. So, so you can really see what I've been talking about where he has an ethnoid jam. So this is one of the first things that I'm going to be working on with him today, if you'll let me, because I don't want to get bitten. Um, but these are things that, that I teach uh, more so in the nasal and ear course. And again, you can see where I'm working on his midlines, checking them out. Um, he can do it through here, through the eyes, not through that neck and getting into that atlas. Some of you too would benefit just from the swallow course because it gets into what that atlas is doing. Um, but it's really important that he has that availability, but you can see where almost where, where the upper cranium palate wants to go up because again, that jam and then that long, long narrow face. So now I, today, I'm going to get in there and really start to try and widen that palate out and see if I can get into the soft tissue there and work on his teeth. Um, and I've got my gloves here for that. Thanks, guys.